Okay, so I decided to work with Evernote and to start off with Evernote has this right up here and you click on it and you can save anything from articles and you can simplify the article. You can mark, mark the full page and then you can also organize it into different notebooks of yours just like as you see here these three I pin to my 4-H notebook but you can also click down here and you can pin it to any notebook and you can add a remark and also add a tag. So here you see my 4-H notebook. I I didn't go as far with this one as I did with the other ones, but I pinned something that's modernizing, and then I also pinned something that's that dates all the way back to 1998. And it's just interesting to read between the, the years how 4-H has come over. I'm also very passionate about FFA. FFA, I, I did something where I just explained some of the offices of FFA if people didn't understand it, and then I also did different views, because I pinned something from PETA, which sees FFA very differently than a kid would or an advisor would and so I explained my views of it if people wanted to scroll through and then I also pinned something some things from FFA to explain what it is what we do I pinned some things about the motivation to participate and then it also has um, some graphs and things about how FFA has helped kids and then finally, I'm very passionate about working with special needs kids. And so I listed the main ideas if people didn't want to scroll through the whole thing. And then here I have an article about teaching children with develop developmental disabilities. I also tagged outside of the classroom because they also work with kids outside of the classroom. And then I highlighted some key things if people wanted to scroll through and just quickly read how you could help kids with de developmental disabilities. Thank you.